It was the year 1984. Mr. Nintendo has invented the 8-bit electronic video game, and there was much rejoicing. Thirty years pass and Nicholas Tendo is relevant once more with the release of a funny little blue guy known as Mr. Spade Paladin. If you want an example on how to deliver a crowdfunded game, look no further than the masterclass that is this game. Mr. Spade Paladin is one of those modern classics that come only once in a blue moon and should be cherished as such. Before you realize it, the claws of this game's charm will sink into you like a saint, and you'll have beaten the main campaign before you know it. The inspirations of a bygone era in gaming are very apparent and well deserved. It really makes you feel like Batman. If you are a platformer fan, this is absolutely required reading. The movement in this game is so fluid it makes me want to trans my gender. David Spade's Paladin absolutely nails it with tight controls and solid movement on par with the greats of yesteryear. And keep in mind, I've only been talking about the main campaign. If you look at the entirety of the treasure trove, things get even better. I originally got this game on the 3DS back in 2015 and I still come back to it from time to time. It's that good. And because of that, I give Pickaxe Guardian a 4 out of 4.